praise God, brothers and sisters, Pastor Catherine from the Pastor Catherine Mothers Show. I hope you actually are looking at the Pastor Catherine Show on a monthly basis. You know, we come on the third Saturday at 11 o'clock and the third Sunday at 8 p.m., which is a repeat. Today, I just want to say I am so thankful to each one of you for following our show and for watching me on this channel. It's an honor. Turn your Bibles to 2 Chronicles 7, 1 through 3, and I'm coming from the NASB, which reads, When Solomon had finished praying, fire came down from heaven, and the glory of the Lord filled the house. The priest could not enter into the house of the Lord because the glory of the Lord filled the Lord's house. Praise God. They worship and gave praise to the Lord. Second Chronicles 7, 1 through 3. How many of us want to see that fire fill God's house again? And when I'm saying God's house, remember, each one of us carries the house of the Lord within us. Amen. Some skeptics examining the Christian life see nothing but rituals. They think prayers are just empty words inspired by wishful thinking, that the Bible is just a collection of myths, and that hymns are just emotional exercises. Some even wonder if Jesus ever really existed. But believers should know the truth. Those who have had a life-changing experience with God, who have been in his presence and have a vital relationship with him, whose lives have been transformed by faith in Yahshua, and who have made him their Lord, who are filled with the Spirit and know that he is real. Amen. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. We think about this dominion, dimension as we consider the dedication of Solomon's temple. As God's people gather for this special event and time of prayer, everything extraordinary happened. Fire came down and the place was filled with the glory of the Lord. This was no religious ritual or emotional experience. It was very real. Overwhelmed, they all bowed down with their faces to the ground. They could not help but worship and praise God. This presence, a powerful picture of true worship for those with a real relationship with God, whose faith is not a ritual or a habit, but who knows that he is real, that Yahshua is the Son of God, and that the Holy Spirit really is with us, that the Bible is true and can change lives. I am a witness. It has changed lives. And it will change joy if you give it half a chance. Praise God. Is this your testimony? Or is your Christian life more ritual than revelation? Ask God to make his presence more real for you. Don't be content with habits or tradition. Seek to be transformed by real encounters with the living God. My prayer is, Father, transform us. Transform me by your presence. Free us. Free me from the boundaries of habits and traditions. Renew 
me and us. Renew us. I worship and praise you in Yeshua. I'm praying for God's anointing on this ministry and every subscriber on YouTube, everyone that looks at the Pastor Catherine Weathers show, Father, we just bless you for blessing us. In Yahshua's mighty name, amen, amen, and amen.